second model from partnership where we are supposed to find out the difference between the share of profits of the two partners. The question here is Pankaj and Nitin started a business by investing rupees 42,000 and 57,000 respectively. So that means investment of Pankaj was 42,000 and investment of Nitin is 57,000. But Nitin left the business after 8 months. So both of them together started the business but Nitin has left the business after 8 months. Find the difference between the share of profits of Pankaj and Nitin if the total profit at the end of the year was 26,000. So very clearly the total profit is 26,000 and we are supposed to find out the difference between the profits of Pankaj and Nitin. To solve this question, we first need to find out the ratio in which the profits is shared by Pankaj and Nitin. And that can be done as discussed earlier. That is, profit of Pankaj is to profit of Nitin should be equal to investment of Pankaj. That is nothing but 42,000 into time of Pankaj's investment. Very clearly, Pankaj started the business and at no point it is mentioned about Pankaj leaving the business. So we can say that Pankaj was present for the total period which is nothing but one year. So we can say Pankaj was there in the business for 12 months. Is to investment made by Nitin which is 57,000 and since Nitin has left the business after 8 months we can say that he was present only for the first 8 months. So time of Nitin's investment should be taken as 8 months. So by simplifying this we get the ratio as 42 into 12 is to 57 into 8 that is nothing but 4 into 2 and 4 into 3 and this is 3 into 19 times and this is 21 times so very clearly the ratio is 21 is to 19 so profit of Pankaj is to profit of Nitin will be equal to 21 is to 19 to find out the difference between the share of profits of Pankaj and Nitin we need not calculate their individual profits Instead, we can directly get the answer by taking the difference from the ratio. As we can see here, the ratio in which Pankaj and Nitin share the profit is 21 is to 19. That means, if the total profit is divided into 21 plus 19, 40 parts. So, if we divide the total profit into 40 parts, out of those 40 parts, 21 parts will belong to Pankaj and remaining 19 parts will belong to Nitin. So as you can see the difference between their profits is two parts as 21 parts go to Pankaj and 19 parts go to Nitin. So we can say that the difference will be equal to two parts out of total 21 plus 19, 40 parts. And this when multiplied by the total profit of 26,000 will give us the actual difference. So by simplifying this we get the answer as 1300 rupees. So we can say that the difference of profits between Pankaj and Nitin will be equal to 1300. So understand that whenever we are supposed to find out the difference, we need not calculate the individual profits. Instead of that, we can simply take the difference between the number of parts shared by them divided by total number of parts into the total profit. 